Hey guys, in this tutorial I will be doing a very bold makeup look inspired by my kicks. And this is what they look like. They're sneaker wedges by Nike. I really like them. I got them from jimmyjazz.com. Awesome website for bold colored kicks like this. So of course I did use like a mustard color. I used gray. I used like a dark gray. It has blue in here too, but I didn't use that. I really hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and if you would like to see it, stay tuned. I first took my Urban Decay Primer Potion all over my eyes. At some point in this video, I'm going to apply some false lashes to the other side, so just warning. <laughs> For a base on my lid, I'm taking my Ben Nye Cream Color in Yellow. I actually didn't blend it out enough on the inner corner, so that's why there's that harsh line. But it kind of works the look a little bit because on the outside, it kind of makes another little curve. So I'm going to try to do the other side like that one now. Taking a clean finger to apply this. Right on top of that, I'm taking Goldenrod Eyeshadow from MAC. It's like a matte, bright mustard color. I'm using a MAC 242 brush to apply this. On the outside, I'm taking a matte gray. This is Copper Plate by MAC. Taking this flat brush from T-Mart. This is going right outside of that Goldenrod. For the outermost corner, I'm taking Typographic from MAC. This is a really dark matte green. Taking a Coastal Scents BRC N08 brush to apply this. I'm taking that golden rod on my inner corner and I'm going to blend it in with my golden rod that's right there. <laughs> Now I'm going to take Insurmountable for my crease. This is my buffer color. I'm taking a MAC 224 brush. I'm taking Chamomile as my brow highlight with a Sigma angle brush similar to the MAC 275. I'm taking my Milani Liquid Eye Pencil in Graphite. It's just a shimmery dark gray. This is going on my outer three-fourths of my lower lash line. To set that, I'm taking MAC Pandemonium Eyeshadow. You could also mix like a black and a silver and get similar. Get a similar shade or could use a similar shade out of your 120 palette. Using a Sigma pencil brush to set it. For my inner corner, I'm using that same brush with MAC Gesso, which is a matte white. For my waterline, I'm taking Gray Utility PowerPoint Eye Pencil from MAC. It is just a gray. I'm going to go ahead and apply my mascara at the top. This is my L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Out Butterfly Mascara in Black is Black. I'm going to line my top lashes or lash line with the e.l.f. Cream Liner in Black. I'll be applying my Stardell Lash number 213s. These can be purchased at shopmissa.com. They're only a dollar. Once I am done, I'll return and show you the rest of my face. For my foundation, I'm taking the NARS Sheer Glow in Cadiz. I'm taking my Sedona Lace number 928 brush. It's just a flat buffer brush. For concealer, I'm taking my Bare Minerals Correcting Concealer SPF 20 in Tan 2 with a Max Coverage Concealer Brush. I will now apply that same mascara I used, the Lash Out Butterfly, to my bottom lashes. I really like that mascara. Hmm, might have to do a review on it. For blush, I'm just going to take Fleur Power from MAC with this T-Mart brush. For a cheap highlight, I'm taking my Definitely Defined Extra Dimension Skin Finish. For my lips, I'm going to take Del Rio, which looks like this. And for the look, I'll zoom you guys in and show you the final look. These are the eyes. And 
on one side is more blended than the other but I didn't want to take it back off to possibly mess it up so I left it. These are my cheeks and my lips. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Check my blog for a list of everything I used and also pictures. And I'll talk to all of you soon. Thanks for watching.